Hey everybody, Breezy here. Um, I know you can tell something's different. Yes, I got my hair flat ironed. Now, before everybody gets like, oh my gosh, you know, whoa. Um, it was a very light flat iron. Um, so Friday, I went to my stylist, who I have not seen in well over a year, because as you all know, I have been natural. I have, I did the big chop over a year ago and the last time I went to my stylist was I think April of last year April or May of last year so it's been well over a year so it was really good to sit in the chair and kind of have somebody you know just messing with you <laughs> I love I love stuff like that I love getting you know pampers so spas and hair and feet and nails I love to do that but anyway um so I went and I told her, you know, I just really want a light flat iron and I want my ends clipped because I didn't need my ends clipped. I mean, it was, you know, inevitable. Um, and so if anybody has is is a hairstylist or um, have hairstylists in the family, I have three generations of hairstylists in my family. My great grandmother, who is still living, thank God, my grandmother and my mother are all um, hairstylists. Um, or beauticians and one thing I know is when they press or straighten someone's hair they want it straight so you could just only imagine how my poor stylist felt when <laughs> I just kept saying just a little just a little I said no no just just go over it lightly it doesn't have to be super straight and she's telling me well, what about the edges just let me just let me get the, just let me get my pressing comb out and get the edges I'm like my edges are okay. They don't need to be super straight. You know, it's all right. So this is pretty much what I came out with. It was um, a little closer to my head the first day or the second day. But um, yeah, over the last couple days, because this is day four. I have um, I've been putting rollers in it just to give it a little bit more, you know, a little bit more, you know, just because, you know, when you've been wearing your hair big and, and you know what I mean, for, for about, oh, for over a year, it, it's weird to have it so close to your face or is that just me? Maybe it's just me. So yeah, this is it. This is it. This is my hair. It is not super straight. It's just straightened and I've had my ends clipped and it looks so nice to have my ends clipped and that's and kind of gives you a idea as you can see you know just, you know just hey um so um I can honestly say that over in the year since I've cut my hair, it was about, like I said in the last video, it was about two to two and a half inches long. Um, to have my hair longer than what it was when I cut it last year and so much healthier. That's really what it's all about. I just, I know people get so caught up in length and length and length. It's good to have health and I'm all for health. And my hair is super healthy. Like I was at work the last few days and that's all, you know, the women were saying, especially, you know, black women. They were just like, oh my God, your hair is just so thick and it just looks so healthy. And I was like, thank you. You know, you know, cause, and these are people that didn't work with me. Um, when I cut my hair last year, this is a new set of people. So they didn't even know me when my hair was super short. They met me this year when my hair was a little bit longer. So they didn't even know what my hair was like before. And what I, in the transition, um, well not even transition, but what my hair was like when it was relaxed to when I cut it and to when it started to really grow out. Because they met me when I was already in my twist out phase. So that's all they know. So to see it like this, they were like, wow, it's just so healthy. I wish I can get my hair like that. And I was like, you can. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. That's my rant. Um, let's see. What do I do? Because I think I'm only, I mean, I'm only going to have my hair like this probably for this week. Just so I can get my, you know, my little money's worth. Um, it's going to be like, you know, straight or flat ironed or whatever. Before I go ahead and go back to my tried and true curly hair that I love so much. My kinky curly that I love so much. Um, but to kind of maintain it every night. I Like I said, I just roll it with <laughs> the old school snap 
uh, rollers. The large magnetic magnetic snap-on rollers. Can you see that? Yeah. Regular old. The large, pretty much all over. And then, uh-oh, I lost the backing, so I got to get another one. And then a jumbo, like the jumbos. The jumbo rollers, you know, in the front, all up in here to just give it a little lift, but in here to kind of, so I can kind of feather it back. But As we all know, towards the end of the day, your hair looks nothing like it did early morning. <laughs> um, that's it, guys. I just really want to come on and just show you guys my um, flat ironed hair. <laughs> to be totally honest, I don't even know what to do with it because I haven't had my hair straightened in so long. Like, I'm like, what do you do? What do I do now? Either roll it or throw it back in a ponytail? <laughs> that's pretty much all I can really think about. I'm like, hmm. Okay, I've, I've kind of forgotten how to maintain, you know, straight hair. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I will talk to you later. Bye.